Well, this morning we are expecting an update on the repairs to fix the OB Pier. The damage from recent storms forcing crews to close it back in January. Yeah, 10 News reporter Nate Holmes live in OB. Nate, the plan here is to have it ready to reopen before the busy summer season. That's right. More than 500 people visit the pier. 500,000 people visit the pier every year, and a lot of that traffic happens during the summer months. So it's good news to know that the pier is expected to be reopened before Memorial Day weekend after it was damaged. And speaking of that damage, now that the sun is up, we can take a look and see it just a little bit better as we zoom the camera in. You can actually see a chunk of the railings on the pier is gone. Now the pier has been closed since January 18th after heavy storms and forceful waves damaged it and for days wood and debris washed up on the shore. Now, Mayor Kevin Faulkner and City Council member Jennifer Campbell are expected to give an update here this morning. We do know that more than 2,000 feet of guardrail, electric sewer and water lines are in need of replacement after those winter storms and repairs are estimated at $430,000. Now the OB Pier is the second largest on the West Coast and the largest concrete pier in the world. Now we will get more details on the repairs coming up at 930 this morning live in Ocean Beach. Nate Holmes, 10 News.